The transport sector has uh, to become more sustainable. It has to reduce emissions and congestions. The rail sector has great potential though, but it's getting very old, it's very complex and it's almost chaotic. It's held up together by a large number of interlocking systems, each one standalone, but depending on others as uh, links in the chain. So this complexity also makes it very hard to oversee uh, the entire infrastructure and foresee problems. There are lots of different systems with different voltages, different needs, different equipment, and they are sourced from different suppliers. So there is actually no way to manage the entire network as one entity. The same is true for power systems used in rail network. They are old, inefficient, they lack the reliability expected today. And if you have a breakdown, it will be very costly to repair and you will have a problem with spares. And there's usually no redundancy on module level. The consequence is energy waste, higher emissions and a higher operating cost. Our technology and solutions fit perfectly to meet this challenge. The key elements are high efficiency, very compact modules, the ability to build power systems from a few building blocks, smart management of an entire system, and now with the Rectiverter, which combines AC and DC output in one module, you get even more flexibility. The advantages for railways are significant. A modular system is scalable and therefore future-proof, with fewer building blocks. Asset management is also simplified. One modular system with one battery backup and one controller catering for several applications and voltage levels will obviously save a lot of space compared to several smaller systems. Simplified maintenance is another advantage. Modules can be hot swapped swiftly with no disturbance to operation. With our management system, you can monitor and control several power systems remotely. Running and maintaining your power systems doesn't have to be complicated. Our way gives you a lower total cost of ownership and a greater contribution towards green mobility.